Fandango Faithful, hey again, we are here at the gas station in Marathon, uh, which is where we took the car, if you remember the scene, uh, this car is afflicted. This is where uh, Pepe Serna, the gas station attendant, made it all right for us. And uh, it, lots of strange memories about this place. If you see the sign here that's a self-service island, there are two pieces of angle iron right there. And it was on that angle iron that I actually cracked my head open and wound up being in the hospital in El Paso when they did the mooning scene. Uh, they're once again proving that it was a stunt butt and not my butt, and my wife can attest to this. That was uh, used in the film. Uh, other things about this particular place, which obviously has changed a lot since we were here last, uh, it was very cold while we were shooting, especially the scene at the at the car wash. Uh, the wind was probably, I don't know, 50 degrees or so, but the wind was howling through there and we were soaking wet, as you saw. And so when we were washing off uh, Phil, trying to get him cleaned off, first of all, they had a dial on the nozzle that they dialed down the pressure because if I tried to hit him with the full force of that, it, it would have literally torn his flesh. But um, we also had some of the crew was kind enough to stand just off camera and use furniture pads so that when we stopped shooting we would the director would call cut and we would run off to the uh, to the to where the furniture pads were wrap the furniture pads around us real quick and just shake until the director said okay let's do it again and we'd be like okay it's warm out here we're good we're good and we'd walk out do it again and then he'd call it cut and we'd run back again and if you look at the scene when I'm when I'm hosing him down and it's a wide shot in the distance you see a tree and you see the tree just shaking in the wind like that, man. You'll see how much wind was out there. Lots of great memories here, lots of fun. Thanks for sticking with us on this Ultimate Fandango uh, commentary and location guide. If you have any questions about what you've seen or about this location or any location of the movie, ultimatefandango.com. That's ultimatefandango.com. Post your question, and I'll answer it as quickly as I can. Join us. There's lots of great uh, uh, things on there, people to talk to who are also passionate about this movie. And uh, we look forward to uh, going to the next location. Right now, we're getting ready to go have three chili dogs and a mom. We'll see you in just a minute.